Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII! Last time we got a submarine! Uh, there we go. And we can dive. And then go back up, and then diving it, you get the idea. Um, there we go. Now, there's a few different things we can do down here. One of them is fight one of the game's super bosses, which we are not doing. We, I would be murdered so fast. Excuse me. Like, you don't even know how fast is how fast. Extremely, extremely fast. Uh, no. What we are gonna do, however, is find- is look around for a couple hidden secret areas. Um, the first one is not really a secret area. I mean, it, honestly, it really is. But it's something we're eventually gonna need to get anyway. So it's easier to just do it right away. But, oh, here it is. There's a cave totally hidden here. <laughs> the guys are still there. And Yuffie's still dancing. It seems li like a key to somewhere. And really old. Analysis complete. Exact date of origin. Undetermined. Estimated to be several thousand years old. I suppose so. We got the key to the ancients! Yay! Incidentally, we are pretty much, uh, if I bring up the big full map, uh, it's not happening. Apparently, cannot bring up the full map underwater. In any case, we are almost directly underneath the city to the ancients. Um, which, as you will recall, was underwater. I think we were a little bit south of it, but the intent is that we the intent, I am fairly sure, is that we inadvertently hit the City of the Ancients. But in any case, that's something we're going to need later on. Not right now. Uh, ne did I just... Okay, you see that right there? That is Emerald Weapon. It will kill us if we run into it. So, don't. Next stop, I think this is correct. Oh hey, it's a su sunken Galenka. I think that's what's called. You know what? This isn't where I was planning on going next, but since we're right here, let's just do it. It's a sunken aeroplane. Literally sunken. Or I say airplane. It looks like an airplane, but I think it's supposed to be the sub we sunk. Honestly, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Oh no, it's an airplane, they sent it right there. Wait, wait, is this the airplane that was going to take off from Juon? You know, just whatever. Heaven's Cloud. Okay, I'm I know that's a weapon, but I don't know for who. Uh Cloud! I guess I, I guess that makes sense. I I thought it might actually be a weapon for Tifa though. Uh is it better than we were using? Sort of. It's stronger. Way stronger. But I would lose my links. Uh, I can handle that, actually. I just need to rearrange a couple things. Uh, oh yeah, I did this. That's just more to have an excuse to have quad Tramatch on than anything else. Uh, fire, water magic. MP plus, mime, heaven's cloud, and it has gr regular growth on it, so it's fine. And let's use the save point. Take fucking two. This time without phone ringing, you won't see me die. But I just got killed by a monster. The monsters in this place are pretty fucking badass. Uh, but there's a lot of good stuff in here, and it's relatively easy to reach it all. Uh, so, just, you know, run away if you find any monsters. As, because they'll kill you. Double cut. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, what do I get rid of for double cut? Um, do I have, no. It might be quadra magic. 
I'm not really using it. I'm mean, I not using the manipulator right now. Uh, right, you know what? I was halfway through saying this, but I didn't really get to it. Every, you know, I don't need luck up. So I digress. Back to this thing. Um, literally every monster in this area can be can be morphed into a source item, which is pretty useful if you're interested in um how to what do I actually want to freaking say? Um Wait. No, Vincent. Death Gigas! Go! Double cut! Go! I lost my trail of thought again. Uh Right. If you want to max out your stats, this is how you do it. You morph all these assholes into um magic shit. No, into sources. Quick! Climb hazard! Also, cure three! I guess I only needed to cure Cloud, really. I mean, if you get hit, she's just plain dead. So... Also, actually a pretty good place for grinding right now. Uh, I think. Well, no, not really. Ooh, lots of money, though. In any case, in any case, the important thing to know... Oh, I just saw another box in there. I need to go back in. Uh... Let's heal first, though. There we go. We're gonna save again. We're gonna be saving a lot in here. Because, well, like I said, the dying that you didn't see because someone fucking phoned me. Again. Three times in 20 minutes. Three different people, three different phone calls in 20 fucking minutes. I'm just... I'm a little bit upset there. I mean, if it's not one thing, it's another. Every fucking time, you know? But yeah, there's totally another box hiding behind that pipe up there. Uh, I can actually take you on. Death blow! Uh, double cut! Uh... Actually, Vincent doesn't need a full heal. And he just attacked, like, three times. In a row. That's pretty cool. Now, if only I could combine Double Cut with Vincent's thing. That would be awesome. But also probably kind of overpowered. Form of Death! You know, I didn't actually need to heal him. He'll heal when he uses Death Gigas. Again. Oh well. Not a big deal. Quick! Franken zombie! Kill Whatever the hell this thing is. Good job. Okie dokie. Um Right, box. The conformer. That's actually a really important weep one. I know what this one is. Behold! Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty powerful. Um, as in her most powerful weapon. It does bonus damage based on the level of, it, of the enemy it's hitting. Uh, and also, incidentally, has an interesting interaction with Morph, where it does not reduce your damage when you attack with Morph. Incidentally, I feel like I just said that. Um, I also double-checked the other ultimate weapons during my last break, uh, just because I know I've been getting the mixed up of it. As it turns out, Vincent's weapon does not actually care about his limit break. Um, it's actually based on, well, something else. What was it? Uh, right, it's actually based on his kill count. Um, Go figure, right? Tifa's weapon actually is based on her limit break like I originally thought. Uh, so yeah, that's how that goes. Hey guys! What's up?
So it would seem there were weapons and material developed solely to destroy Sephiroth. But it was attacked by a weapon and sunk to the bottom of the sea. Yeah, sure you will. So, quite simple here. Make sure you steal their stuff. Uh, they have some really... This is the sort of scenario where I kind of wish I had regular steel. Um, seriously? Well, at least he woke himself up. Yeah, I mean, no, obviously you don't have anything to steal, Cloud. You're the one who's doing the stealing. Right, so, as I was saying, all from here on out, every battle with the Turks, they will have really good accessories that we can steal from them. Or possibly armor in the case of Rude, I'm not 100% on that. Uh, so we want to make damn sure that we get them. And we got them. Awesome. Double cut, go! Let's see, let's use Alexander. Again, D come on. Oh, oh my. Uh, Vincent! Uh, oh. Okay, little bit problematic. I need to hit Cloud before he can, you know, shoot someone else. And hopefully this will not result in Vincent shooting himself. Because that would be just... That would just be really embarrassing on a lot of levels. Uh, you just shoot one of them. Correct choice! Uh, also correct choice there, Yuffie. Uh, just do that to Vincent, he's immune. Thank you. Kill him! Before he does more confusion bullshit. You know, maybe this would be what. Oh. Please don't use that on the Turks. Damn it, Yuffie! You just casted haste. Protect and shell on the Turks. I hope you're happy with yourself. You're at oh okay, we did it. Well, we we took care of Reno anyway. He was the one who was doing the confusion, so I feel like he was the more important target. Even though I do still need to deal with y Yuffie's incompetence. Well, hopefully it won't last too long. Wait, do I have a spell on anyone? Probably not. It's it's pretty unlikely. Excuse me. Hmm. But all Reno does is hit people. I mean, admittedly, he's pretty good at it, but... You know, he hasn't actually done anything for a while. Maybe putting casting haste on him actually screwed up the AI. That would be interesting. I know that there are some games that are like that, like Bravely Default. If you screw around with the... If you use either Haste World or Slow World, it seriously screws around with the AI. It doesn't know how to... For the bosses, they just do not know how to handle it. Uh, in any case, this is not Bravely Default. Maybe someday. But not today. So it would seem. We'll go through that door in a minute. Uh, I said we'll go through that door in a minute! Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. We need to get out of here! Please run away. Well, it's a good thing Vincent's there to body block for me. Seriously. Let me go save. I just fought the damn Turks. Oh yeah, let's look at those uh, things we got. Um, tough ring, plus 50 spirit and vitality. So, mega defense boost. And the this thing. No slots, but cuts everything in half, and it hits really good armor. 
I don't know if I'll necessarily use Rude's thing. Reno's thing is actually really damn good, though, so probably will use that at some point. Maybe. I mean, it's hard to say for sure, just because I really like ribbons and immunity to half of the, the elements in the game. Both of those things are really good. Uh, plus also Cloud's stealing thing, but that's... That's, that's not going to be on forever. Okay, another Mega Elixir. Um, anything over here? Yes! And I see that Materia down there. And a Spirit Lance. That's another Weep On for Sid. Actually, I thought that there was... I'm not seeing anything else, but I thought there was another really important one here that I haven't... that I have not yet seen. Wait. Did it just counterattack? It did. Let's get out of here. Because that seems like it is most likely... I mean, it's clearly a counterattack, and it seems like it probably inflicts a status effect. Uh... Oh, it inflicts sadness. Actually, that's not so bad. I can deal with that. I mean, m and more to the point, after it's inflicted it once, what do I care if it does it again? Let's see, I know all of the monsters on here have over 10,000 HP. I don't know, I don't know what the specific numbers for each monster, but I know they're all over 10,000. So, how much have I done so far? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8? Probably? Yeah, around 8, I'd say. Okay. That should go up to 10. Uh, maybe I should attack. Oh, it ran out of MP. Okay, yeah, that hurt a lot. Um... And it's dead. We did it! We mastered Chocobo Mog! Now we can stop using... Master Materia? Wait, I'm confused. I thought I didn't get that until I mastered all of my Materia. Maybe that's just one for each type of Materia, but I don't think I've done that either. I have- that's only the second material I've mastered. Wait, no, maybe the third. Um... Let's- let's look. Uh, there's the Chocobo Mog, of course. The new one. When you master a cho uh, material, you get a new one. I have mastered, I want to say, Lightning. Uh... yep, right there. And... Is that it? Yeah, that's it. I've mastered two materia. So that wasn't the first materia I've mastered, and I clearly haven't mastered one of each type. And I'm pretty sure that achievement is supposed to be for mastering everything. So I really don't know what's going on there. Uh, in any case, I don't need Chocobo Mog anymore. <laughs> we can swap that out for- actually, hold that thought. There's a, there was a summon materia on the floor of the room we are currently in. I happen to know what it is. And I think it's a great thing to replace the Chocobo Mog. No kidding. Of course, unfortunately... Behold, Hades! Uh, as I was saying, though. Of course, unfortunately, I cannot actually sell my Master Chocobo Mog, because I'm gonna need it later. Um, I can... I, once I start mastering these alls, I can sell them? Because it doesn't really ma- they're worth tons of money. It doesn't really matter to me too much to not have- to not have a max out all. And they're fairly quick to master. Not as quick as lightning, evidently, but almost. Lightning or Chocobo Mog. Hmm. In any case, I'll have tons of them, so selling one or two will be fine. And it will basically solve all of my money problems. In any case, Hades. Hades is a summon that inflicts all of the status effects. All of them. Pretty much. I don't know if you can combine it with add effect 
or not, though. That's something I sh that is something I should look into. Hmm. Then, in any case, uh, let's go open those last couple boxes. And then, GTFO! We got I win! Awesome. We'll look at that in a minute. And Ice is maxed out. Man, we're getting lots of these all of a sudden. Last one, Outsider. I have no idea what that is, but I do know what the high wind is. It is! I think you can guess who this is. Oh, apparently it's a gun. How does that compare to your current gun, Vincent? Uh, I'd say fairly well. Yeah. Yeah. L let's do that. Also, don't need ice anymore. Uh, element though. Hmm. Well, I guess that means we're gonna put a new, give you a new element material, mental materia. I could do poison. I'm pretty sure that counts as an element. It's not a very rare one though. No, rather, it is a very, a fairly rare one. Gravity is an element, but it's also lame. Uh. Hmm. I could do earth. Earth isn't much of an element either, but it's at least... Hmm. You know, I think I will do poison, just because it's the closest one to ma being mastered. Uh, I may as well put some stuff in here as well. Just... Just like no-brainer stuff. I do need to master a chocobo lure. So, let's throw that in there as well. Even though it's not really useful. Uh, range, and now let's GTFO. Uh, wait, 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 wait! I'm me. I'm pop. No, not by name, by type. I'm maybe being a little bit neurotic with this, with the sorting, but whatever. We're done here. We're gonna. Uh, yeah, we're gonna run away from that. And uh, assuming I don't die. I think this is a good place to stop off! So, join... Good job, Yuffie. Uh, right, so, join me next time when we do more stuff with our submarine. Until then, this has been Final Fantasy VII, and have... with Cast Blue. <laughs> and have a great day. Bye!